Hello viewers, uh, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we want to talk about Hong Kong PhD fellowships and these are 300 uh, PhD fellowships and these are fully funded and uh, so the uh, title of today's video is 300 Hong Kong PhD fellowship scheme to uh, 2021 this is fully funded scheme so the every year uh, the government of Hong Kong uh, it announces this scheme for the PhD students so Hong Kong is uh, accepting application for the Hong Kong PhD fellowship scheme 2021 so if you have no IELTS then no problem without IELTS so there will be 300 scholarships and it will be given to few different universities of Hong Kong which will be listed today and uh, in, uh, I will explain in this video the list of those universities as well it will be given in 2021 note that bachelor's degree studies students 16 years of education can directly apply for these fellowships so this is good news for the students who have got 16 year education and the master's students can also apply for directly for this uh, fellowships uh, the uh, master's students can also apply for Hong Kong scholarship for international students uh, so uh, we are now uh, got the news that finally after one year the most amazing scholarship programs are going to open by Hong Kong government uh, top eight universities of Hong Kong are participating in the Hong Kong PhD Fellowship Scheme program. Candidates can apply in any academic field of study available at the universities. There are no academic background restrictions. So 300 scholarships will be given to study in the Hong Kong uh, for the year 2021. So. Hong Kong is a very developed country so this is a good opportunity if you get a PhD fellowship uh, for your studies there is no need for IELTS test as well this is also good news and uh, if you have studied the previous if you have studied previously in English medium and your previous degree for example if you are uh, you have done the masters and you have your uh, medium of instruction in the master degree was English so there is no need to provide the IELTS test and similarly uh, for the other degrees which you have completed before applying for this fellowship no need uh, to provide the IELTS test so this is uh, I mean more students can apply uh, for this fellowship the aim of the Hong Kong uh, government scholarship uh, attracting the best and uh, brightest students in the world to pursue their direct PhD studies in Hong Kong so this is competitive uh, fellowship program so you must be very uh, good and uh, must you must be very lucky to get this fellowship because this is only 300 fellowships and people will apply from around the world the fellowship will cover all the expenses during the scholarship for the full duration of the program and Hong Kong universities are among the top top hundred universities in the world so there are eight top universities of Hong Kong and uh, let's go in more detail about uh, this this fellowship program uh, so details about uh, this fellowship program countries Hong Kong number of scholarship 300 courses the course level is PhD eligible countries all nationals can apply financial coverage this is fully funded scholarship and deadline so 2nd of December 2020 so and there's less time remaining now nearly uh, one week for the application scholarship background so it is established by the research grants council of Hong Kong it was this fellowship was established in 2009 and by then it has going to be offered 
Hong Kong is a free and dynamic society. Hong Kong is a, a, uh, is a good country and dynamic society where creativity and the in, entrepreneurship uh, coverage strategically located in the heart of Asia. So universities in Hong Kong offer special strengths a wide choice of disciplines in de developing the city into a regional and international hub of higher education and talent development. A list uh, of cities, a list of sorry universities are partic participating in Hong Kong fellowships. These are the eight universities which are participating in the in this uh, program. So these are top class universities. City like City University of Hong Kong, Hong Kong um, Baptist uh, University, and Lin Kang University, Ling Nan University, and the Chinese University of Hong Kong, the Education University of Hong Kong, the Hong Kong Polytechnical Polytechnic University, the Hong Kong University of Science and Technology, and the University of Hong Kong. So all are famous universities. So. Um, Available available fields and major science, medicine, engineering and technology, humanities, social sciences and business sciences, business studies. So most of the fields are covered by these universities. And now the attractive package of this scholarship. So this uh, fellowship is uh, very attractive and these are the financial benefits. Annual stipends will be given. And an annual stipend will be given uh, that's nearly 40,000 uh, 40, US dollars. So annually, this uh, this package is equivalent to 40,000 US dollars. Or if you going to want, uh, if you want to find the amount in Hong Kong dollars, so the three zero nine six double zero Hong Kong dollars. This is for uh, covering uh, to cover the housing and meals. And there will be no tuition fee for this. And this uh, for the fellowship holders there will be no tuition fees and the conference research related travel grant will also be awarded if you want to attend a conference research based conference then you can get an uh, 12,900 Hong Kong dollar as travel allowance for awardees who need more than three years for example if you are not going to able to complete your PID in three years and you need some extra time uh, for example, six months or one year, then uh, the additional funds, additional support will also be provided by the chosen universities. For details, uh, you can contact directly to the universities. Selection criteria is ac academic excellence. You must have got the excellent grades. Research ability, you must have a good research ability to pursue the research and communication skills and interpersonal skills should be very good and leadership abilities should you should possess leadership uh, abilities for, for to be accepted for this fellowship so deadline is 2nd of december uh, to apply for 2021 fellowship how to apply for the Hong Kong so this is a method to apply for this fellowship uh, eligible candidates should first make an initial application online through the Hong Kong PhD Fellowship Scheme electronic system. So uh, first they should make some initial application through online by visiting the link, this link, by visiting this link, uh, they, they should first make some initial application through the online system. And uh, this application should be made before the December 2020 and uh, before submitting application for the PIT admission to their desired year. And afterwards you can submit uh, your application to the your desired universities, one of uh, 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 among these eight, eight universities. Application may choose up to two program departments at one or two universities for PID study. Under this program, you can choose one program or two programs under in one or two universities. They should comply with the admission requirements of their selected universities and 
uh, program so you should comply you should comply complete all the procedure of the admission and uh, you must uh, possess those uh, requirements to be selected uh, for the selection uh, to to be able to be selected in these for this fellowship as a deadline for the applications to some the universities may immediately follow that of the initial applic uh, application candidates should submit initial application as early as possible to ensure that they have sufficient time to submit application to the universities so these are the step to apply submit initial application to research grant council so first you should submit the initial application to the research grant council and secondly submit the full application to the proposed universities so these are the two steps for the uh, application and after completing an initial application application submit full application for their selected PIT program to the proposed universities quoting their HKPFS reference you will when you will make the initial application you will get a reference and then that reference you should quote while applying for the university admission so that reference number before the university's respective deadlines so the deadline of the universities may differ from university to university but for the deadline for the initial application that is 2nd of December so you must apply by before the 2nd of December and must get the HKPFS reference number so that you can quote that reference number while applying for the universities so to apply for this for to follow the to start the procedure of application you must go to this link for the initial application and there is more uh, details about the application process so I hope you like uh, you have understood the video and you have understood all the details about most of the details about this fellowship uh, kindly um, subscribe this channel so that you can get more videos about different scholarships around the world thank you very much for being with us